hey you guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'm going to be doing a love reading for the zodiac sign of libra so if you have libra in your birth chart this video may resonate with you so don't forget to like share comment and subscribe so let's see what's going on for libra for my collective spirit guys of the light and justice and analysis. my angels of the pure and light light So we have the hangman, so it could be connected to a Pisces, Libra. We have here the two of cups. Okay, so I'm seeing here that it's either you or someone that you was connected to or connected to now could be stuck in a connection and a relationship here. But they don't want to, somebody here don't want to be there. Six of Wands, somebody here just stand there because of social expectations. Okay, because they care about what everybody else think. Somebody here, I'm guessing to feel like somebody here looks good on their arm, like prize possession. They give them more like, more popular or looked at regarding the community. Or it's like somebody here likes to get like public recognition, attention from their homeboys or something like, yeah, your, your girlfriend bad or something like that. It boosts their ego. Okay, we have Nine of Pentacles here and the Nine of Cups. Well, this person will even have to be like, this person could be ugly, okay? But it's like, whoever that they're dating makes them look like a king, like boost their ego. And this person likes to look like that to the public. He has the Nine of Pentacles and the Nine of Cups. So I'm seeing here, okay, that Libra, you could be single right now, okay? As somebody here is trying to make you jealous by staying in a relationship here that they're not even happy in, okay? Yeah, you are doing good financially. You could be receiving a lot of public recognition. Somebody here could be in the spotlight, okay? You could have a lot of people trying to come in towards you, give you that cup of love. Okay, if Nine of Cups here. Because you look bad as hell. And we have the Three of Pentacles here. Yeah, somebody here put you part of a third party situation. It's like this person was in and out. It's like this person likes to have attention on them, people defer with them. Even though they're already in a connection, this person cheats on whoever that they with. We have the Three of Cups here. This person could go out and party a lot. Okay, somebody here can be into like polyamorous relationships. They, somebody here could have a business here with someone that they're dating or talking to. Okay, we have the two of wands in reverse, so they cut ice. Yeah, somebody here has a sex addiction, okay? And we have the four of pentacles here. Some of you guys could be starting a new project here. Okay, you're finding out that you're passionate about something here. Okay. Some of you guys are also celebrating as well. I'm seeing here, Libra. It's like you are doing very good regarding your career. Your money's looking good. And it's like you're celebrating. Okay. You could be going on a trip. Yeah. You also is very good at saving your money with the Four of Pentacles here. And I'm also seeing here that somebody is holding on to you. We have the Six of Cups here. Yeah, this person wants to return to you. They miss you. They're thinking about all the good times that you guys have with each other. And we have here the King of Wands. Yeah, so you could have been dealing with somebody here that was popular, a leader, okay? This person was very ambitious when it came to, like, money and their, how they looked, their reputation. We have the source here. Yeah, this person broke your heart, okay? Yeah, they caused you a lot of pain here with their swords. Okay, we have the chariot. Yeah, but I'm seeing you overcame that. Okay, that heartbreak here regarding your emotions and you move forward from that. Okay, and I'm seeing here you are either talking to somebody or you're manifesting a connection here where it's going to be peaceful. You guys are going to work together as a team, work very well with each other with the four of wands here. You guys are going to travel with each other. You're going to be living together. Some of you guys could be getting proposed to as well. Seven Pentacles here. Yeah, this person is like really going to invest in you. 
Okay, you're going to invest in them. It's going to be equal give and take. Some of you guys, yeah, I'm sitting here, Libra, you could be having your hands in like a lot of things. You could be invested in certain things here and it's going to see the fruits of your labor. Okay, if you haven't already. And we have the lovers here. So I'm also seeing here that you could have you know, options when it comes to love and you're trying to see who you should invest in. Okay, like, you know, who got what going for they sell. Like, you don't want to date no bum. So, you guys, this person that broke your heart could have been like a twin flame of yours. Yeah, and this person is teaching you how to love yourself. The Queen of Cups here. Okay, I'm seeing here. Some of you guys could be psychic. You're very kind, sweet, romantic, sensitive. Some of you guys could be pregnant right now, Libra. Okay. Um, we have the Eight of Pentacles here. Some of you guys could be a single mother, a single parent. But you're just focusing on your abundance right now, your work. With the Eight of Pentacles here, you could be self-employed, you could have your own business, or you could have just started a new job. We have here the High Priestess. Yeah, some of you guys, it's like very like spiritual. Like you're, you could be a tarot reader. You're very observing with the High Priestess here. We have here the Queen of Swords. You're very intelligent and wise. Okay, it's like you're ahead of your time. Okay, you're very honest. A lot of people see you as funny. The Queen of Swords. We have the full card. It's like people come to you for the truth. You know? Like somebody knows that you're not gonna like give them the wrong advice. Okay, you have a lot of wisdom. With the full card here, I'm seeing here that you move forward until you started something new for yourself, whether that been like moving from to a different city. Or a state. Or just doing something different here. Like you're starting something new for yourself. We have the devil card here. Let's see. Clarify the devil. Some of you guys is getting away from some type of addiction that you had. Okay. But it's like if you feel like it keep pulling you back. Like that's your weakness or something. We have here the six of pentacles. So I'm seeing here you was dealing with somebody here. Okay, you could have helped this person out financially. Okay. With some of you guys, I thought this person is holding on to you. Okay, somebody here is addicted to your sex as well. Okay. It's like that's their weakness. And it's like this person is gonna try to like give you some money or buy you a gift here so you can come back towards them. Okay, because this person misses your sex. Two of Pentacles say, yeah, this person was juggling you. And I'm also saying some of you guys, I'll probably help this person with finances or something like that. So be careful because this person is struggling with their finances right now with the Two of Pentacles. And they need your help. They're going to be coming and asking for your help. Okay, but this person is like toxic as hell. Okay. Can I find the Queen of Swords? Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, you're very abundant here. Okay, you're very luxurious. Okay, you take care of people that's close to you. That's why this person probably going to try to come back towards you. They see you moving like far away from them. It's like time keep, you know, getting, time keep going by. And it's like this person just like, they feel like you're slipping away from them. And they're trying to think like, how can they get you back? This person could be in a relationship too, but they want you back. They miss the sex with you. Or they just want to come back and, and you know, cause conflict because their life is not going good like they're putting on a facade like they're happy the whole time this person is you let's see give me some messages that this person wants to tell Libra spirit guides of a night and masters it's crazy how these people be living double lives like what the hell is going on in the air like what's going on what's going on Removing negative energies from the sex for gods of the night and just the masters. And each of the parent and the night. So let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. I have 
hearing the cards fall off my table. Like, Jesus Christ. Now I gotta bend all the way over just to get the cards. What else? This person wants to tell Libra. It's for a guy doing light. I'm just the master. My angel is crying light. Okay. So we have, I'm coming back. So this person is saying they're coming back. Like, they ain't even ask you, can they come back? They just saying they're coming back. Okay. But you're going to be the judge of that. So let's see. Okay, it says you make me believe in love. So you make this person believe in love, Libra. Like you're super loving, super sweet, super kind, and love the two people. I want to worship you from head to toe. Yeah, so I must definitely see that this person can be in love with two people for some of you guys. Some, okay? I feel like a new person want to worship you from head to toe. Okay, me and my person argue over you. So if they have somebody, they be arguing like, why are you still bring up this bitch? Why are you still look at this? No, blah, 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 blah. Like, who cares? You didn't deserve that. Ex-lover. Yeah, so this ex-lover is saying that you didn't deserve that. Okay? So this is going to be my thumbnail. We have here... I'm hiding a lot right now, red flag. We have our connection is so much deeper than just sex. We have using magic on you. I keep saying this in my readings. So this person can be trying to use magic on you to bring you back. I'm unhappy in my current relationship. Do we see that in the reading? Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces that you can be connected to or this person can have it in their chart. Okay, are they super emotional about you? Outside haters, so somebody is hating on you. And the fact that this person still has feelings for you, please trust me again. So this person wants you to trust them again. I'm falling in love. So this new person is falling in love with you, better off alone. So you could be feeling like you're better off alone, Libra. Okay, I didn't know how much I love you until I lost you. Jealous, possessive, controlling, abusive. Yeah, you have to get away from that energy. My person is jealous of you. And this person is jealous as well. So, ugh. I try to replace you, but it's impossible. I imagine growing old with you. I want to hold you again. Spying, creeping, stalking, lurking, investigating, watching you. I'm afraid that I don't have enough to offer you. I'm so grateful that we met. Yeah, see, this person don't feel like they have enough to offer you, so they're going to try to come in towards you and see if you got something to offer them, which is crazy. Okay, I respect you for setting strong boundaries. Yeah, you, you, you cut this person off. Will you marry me? And left on red and seen. So this person could let you on red and seen, or you left them on red and seen. Okay, so I hope this video gave you guys a lot of clarity. Thank you for watching my video leaper if this gave you any clarity don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye